Good morning, good morning. I hope y'all slept well. I know I did. Our word today comes from Psalms, and it is chapter 8, verses 3 through 4. And it is, when I look at your heavens, the work of your fingers, the moon and the stars that you have established, what are human beings that you are mindful of them, mortals that you care for them? So here, can you imagine David sitting here seeing the beauty of outdoors every single day? Because he worked out with the sheep. So day and night, you're seeing beautiful sunrises and beautiful sunsets, and you're seeing the stars, and you're seeing nature, just the way God created it. It's quiet, you can think. And to think about God making everything with such ease and such magnificence and then wondering why he's bothering with me and i sit outside and i look and i listen and i love it i love nature especially with a cup of coffee <laughs> but to just marvel at what god can do what god has done and you wonder, what is it about me that makes you pay attention to me? And it's not so much, to me, it's not so much me per se as the potential in me that he created. I'm created in his image. There are so many wonderful things that I can do with him, through him. You know, I can do all things through Christ Jesus who strengthens me. So. Just thinking about that and marveling at the fact that he loves me enough, us enough, to have taken the time to make us so intricately and to want to be involved in our lives because of the potential in us to do great things. We can all do wonderful things. Get in the book, read the book listen to his word, ask for wisdom. And then those things that you love to do that you just can't think about not doing, those are gifts and use them. Go and apply yourself and use them and stretch them to the best of your ability and ask God to be with you as you are doing that one thing that you are so gifted in. That is a blessing. And it's going to open doors and it's going to help people in ways you can't possibly imagine. We're not supposed to understand him. We are just grateful that he pays attention to us, that he created us, that he came back and justified us so that we could go home. He put us here for a purpose. So find that purpose that he put within you. Find that gift that he has given you and start working on it and start stretching it. Be creative. It's in you. Whether your creativity is like anybody else's doesn't matter. What matters is that you found your gift and you're using it. And when you use it, God will open doors for you. And it's going to be amazing. Just pay attention and you'll see his hand. And that's the most awesome thing is to see his hand working in your life. To put pen to paper. I like to write. And to see the things that come out and to watch them touch somebody else when they read them is awesome. And sometimes you don't even realize the work that you've done. And it's not what you did by yourself. It's what he did through you. So the next time you're marveling at the skies, at nature, at an animal, and you see God. His hand is in you and on you, just like it's on nature, just like it's on that animal. You just have to take the time to see it and develop it. And it's going to be awesome. Y'all have a great day. Um, I hope you were blessed and I'm going to go start work. Bye.